Hindu texts are manuscripts and historical literature related to any of the diverse traditions within Hinduism. A few texts are shared resources across these traditions and broadly considered as Hindu scriptures. These include the Vedas and the Upanishads. Scholars hesitate in defining the term Hindu scripture. Given the diverse nature of Hinduism, many include Bhagavad Gita and Agamas as Hindu scriptures, while Dominic Goodall includes Bhagavata Purana and Yajnavakya Smriti to the list of Hindu scriptures. There are two historic classifications of Hindu texts Shruti, that which is heard, and Smriti, that which is remembered. The Sruti refers to the body of most authoritative, ancient religious texts, believed to be eternal knowledge authored neither by human nor divine agent but transmitted by sages. Rishis. These comprise the central canon of Hinduism. It includes the four Vedas including its four types of embedded texts, the Samhitas, the Brahmanas, the Aranyakas and the early Upanishads. Of the Shrutis Vedic corpus, the Upanishads alone are widely influential among Hindus, considered scriptures par excellence of Hinduism, and their central ideas have continued to influence its thoughts and traditions. The Smriti texts are a specific body of Hindu texts attributed to an author, as a derivative work they are considered less authoritative than Sruti in Hinduism. The SMRTI literature is a vast corpus of diverse texts, and includes but is not limited to Vedangas, the Hindu epics, the sutras and shastras, the texts of Hindu philosophies, the Puranas, the Kavya or poetical literature, the Basiyas, and numerous Nibandhas digests covering politics, ethics, culture, arts and society. Many ancient and medieval Hindu texts were composed in Sanskrit, many others in regional Indian languages. In modern times, most ancient texts have been translated into other Indian languages and some in Western languages. Prior to the start of the Common Era, the Hindu texts were composed orally, then memorized and transmitted orally, from one generation to next, for more than a millennia before they were written down into manuscripts. This verbal tradition of preserving and transmitting Hindu texts, from one generation to next, continued into the modern era. Vedas. The Vedas are a large body of Hindu texts originating in ancient India, with its Samhita and Brahmanas complete before about 800 BCE. Composed in Vedic Sanskrit hymns, the texts constitute the oldest layer of Sanskrit literature and the oldest scriptures of Hinduism. Hindus consider the Vedas to be apaurusya, which means, not of a man, superhuman, and impersonal, authorless. The knowledge in the Vedas is believed in Hinduism to be eternal, uncreated, neither authored by human nor by divine source, but seen, heard and transmitted by sages. Vedas are also called sruti, what is heard, literature, distinguishing them from other religious texts, which are called smriti, what is remembered. The Veda, for orthodox Indian theologians, are considered revelations, some way or other the work of the deity. In the Hindu epic the Mahabharata, the creation of Vedas is credited to Brahma. There are four Vedas, the Rigveda, the Yajurveda, the Samaveda and the Atharvaveda. Each Veda has been subclassified into four major text types, the Samhitas mantras and benedictions, the Aranyakas text on rituals, ceremonies, sacrifices and symbolic sacrifices, the Brahmanas commentaries on rituals, ceremonies and sacrifices, and the Upanishads text discussing meditation, philosophy and spiritual knowledge. Topic. Upanishads The Upanishads are a collection of Hindu texts which contain some of the central philosophical concepts of Hinduism. The Upanishads are commonly referred to as Vedanta, variously interpreted to mean either the last chapters, parts of the Veda, or the object, the highest purpose of the Veda. The concepts of Brahman ultimate reality and Atman soul, self are central ideas in all the Upanishads, and know your Atman, their thematic focus. The Upanishads are the foundation of Hindu philosophical thought and its diverse traditions. Of the Vedic corpus, they alone are widely known, and the central ideas of the Upanishads have had a lasting influence on Hindu philosophy. More than 200 Upanishads are known, of which the first dozen or so are the oldest and most important and are referred to as the principal or main Mukya Upanishads. The Mukya Upanishads are found mostly in the concluding part of the Brahmanas and Aranyakas and were, for centuries, memorized by each generation and passed down verbally. The early Upanishads all predate the Common Era, some in all likelihood pre-Buddhist 6th century BCE, down to the Maurya period. 
Of the remainder, some 95 Upanishads are part of the Muktika canon, composed from about the start of Common Era through medieval Hinduism. New Upanishads, beyond the 108 in the Muktika canon, continued being composed through the early modern and modern era, though often dealing with subjects unconnected to Hinduism. <laughs> Post-Vedic texts The texts that appeared afterwards were called Smriti. Smriti literature includes various shastras and ithihasas epics like Ramayana, Mahabharata, Harivamsa Puranas, Agamas and Darshanas. The sutras and shastras texts were compilations of technical or specialized knowledge in a defined area. The earliest are dated to later half of the first millennium BCE. The Dharma shastras law books, derivatives of the Dharma sutras. Other examples were Bhautika Shastra, physics, Rasayana Shastra, Chemistry, Jivashastra, Biology, Vastashastra, Architectural Science, Shilpashastra, Science of Sculpture, Arthashastra, Economics, and Nidashastra, Political Science. It also includes tantras and agama literature. This genre of texts includes the sutras and shastras of the six schools of Hindu philosophy. <laughs> Puranas The Puranas are a vast genre of Hindu texts that encyclopedically cover a wide range of topics, particularly myths, legends and other traditional lore. Composed primarily in Sanskrit, but also in regional languages, several of these texts are named after major Hindu deities such as Lord Vishnu, Lord Shiva and Goddess Devi. The Puranic literature is encyclopedic, and it includes diverse topics such as cosmogony, cosmology, genealogies of gods, goddesses, kings, heroes, sages, and demigods, folk tales, pilgrimages, temples, medicine, astronomy, grammar, mineralogy, humor, love stories, as well as theology and philosophy. The content is highly inconsistent across the Puranas, and each Purana has survived in numerous manuscripts which are themselves inconsistent. The Hindu Puranas are anonymous texts and likely the work of many authors over the centuries. In contrast, most Jaina Puranas can be dated and their authors assigned. There are 18 Maha Puranas, Great Puranas and 18 Upa Puranas, Minor Puranas with over 400,000 verses. The Puranas do not enjoy the authority of a scripture in Hinduism, but are considered a smriti. These Hindu texts have been influential in the Hindu culture, inspiring major national and regional annual festivals of Hinduism. The Bhagavata Purana has been among the most celebrated and popular text in the Puranic genre. The Tavaram Saivite hymns The Tavaram is a body of remarkable hymns exuding bhakti composed more than 1,400 to 1,200 years ago in the classical Tamil language by three Saivite composers. They are credited with igniting the bhakti movement in the whole of India. Topic Divya Prabandha Vaishnavite hymns The Nalayura Divya Prabandha or Nalayura 4, 000, Divya Prabhamdam is a divine collection of 4,000 verses Nalayura in Tamil means 4, 000, composed before 8th century AD 1, by the 12 Alvars, and was compiled in its present form by Nathamuni during the 9th-10th centuries. The Alvars sung these songs at various sacred shrines. These shrines are known as the Divya Desams. In South India, especially in Tamil Nadu, the Divya Prabandha is considered as equal to the Vedas, hence the epithet Dravida Veda. In many temples, Sarangam, for example, the chanting of the Divya Prabandham forms a major part of the daily service. Prominent among the 4,000 verses are the 1,100 plus verses known as the Thiru Vimazi, composed by Namalvar Karl Maran Sadagapan of Thurak Kuragor. Topic other Hindu texts Hindu texts for specific fields, in Sanskrit and other regional languages, have been reviewed as follows. Topic origin of arts and sciences in India The Hindu scriptures provide the early documented history and origin of arts and sciences forms in India such as music, dance, sculptures, architecture, astronomy, science, mathematics, medicine and wellness. Valmiki's Ramayana 500 BCE to 100 BCE mentions music and singing by Gandharvas, dance by Asparas such as Urvashi, Ramba, Manaka, Tilatama Panchasparas, and by Ravana's wives who excelling in Narityagita or singing and dancing and Nritavaditra or playing musical instruments. 
The evidence of earliest dance-related texts are in Nata Sutras, which are mentioned in the text of Panini, the sage who wrote the classic on Sanskrit grammar, and who is dated to about 500 BCE. This performance arts-related sutra text is mentioned in other late Vedic texts, as are two scholars' names Shilalan and Krishishva credited to be pioneers in the studies of ancient drama, singing, dance and Sanskrit compositions for these arts. Richmond et al. estimate the Natasutras to have been composed around 600 BCE, whose complete manuscript has not survived into the modern age. Topic see also Hindu epics List of Hindu scriptures List of historic Indian texts List of sutras Sanskrit literature Prasthanatrayi topic Notes topic References topic Bibliography APTE, Vaman Shivram The Practical Sanskrit Dictionary. Delhi, Mudalal Banarsidas Publishers. ISBN 81-208-0567-4. Dusan, Paul, Bedekar, V. M. T. R., Palsal, T. R., G. B. 1997. Sixty Upanishads of the Veda, Vol. 2. Mudalal Banarsidas. ISBN 978-81-208-1467-7. King, Richard, Akarya, Gaudapada Early Advaita Vedanta and Buddhism, The Mahayana Context of the Gaudapadiya Karika, Sunni Press, ISBN 978-0-7914-2513-8 Collins, Randall 2000. The Sociology of Philosophies, A Global Theory of Intellectual Change. Harvard University Press. ISBN 0-674-00187-7. Mahadevan, TMP Sarvpali Radhakrishnan, ed., History of Philosophy Eastern and Western, George Allen and Unwin Limited McDonnell, Arthur Anthony 2004. A Practical Sanskrit Dictionary. Mudalal Banarsidas. ISBN 978-81-208-2005. Olivelle, Patrick The Samyusha Upanishads. Oxford University Press. ISBN 978-0-19-507045-3. Olivelle, Patrick Upanishads, Oxford University Press, ISBN 978-0-19-283576-5 Radhakrishnan, S. Moore, C. A. A Source Book in Indian Philosophy. Princeton, New Jersey, Princeton University Press. ISBN 978-0-691-01958-1. Renata, R.D. 1926, A Constructive Survey of Upanishadic Philosophy, Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan Varghese, Alexander P. 2008, India, History, Religion, Vision and Contribution to the World, Volume 1, Atlantic Publishers and Distributors, ISBN 978-81-269-0903-2 Further reading R. C. Zainer Hindu Scriptures, Penguin Random House, ISBN 978-0-679-41078-2 Dominic Goodall, Hindu Scriptures, University of California Press, ISBN 978-0-520-20778-3 Jessica Frazier, 2014, The Bloomsbury Companion to Hindu Studies, Bloomsbury Academic, ISBN 978-1-4725-1151-5 External links Manuscripts Collections incomplete, A Handlist of Sanskrit and Prakrit Hindu, Buddhist and Jain Manuscripts Held by the Wellcome Library, Volume 1, Compiled by Dominic Wujistic includes subjects such as historic dictionaries, drama, erotics, ethics, logic, poetics, medicine, philosophy, etc. A handlist of Sanskrit and Prakrit Hindu, Buddhist and Jain manuscripts held by the Wellcome Library, Volume 2, compiled by Dominic Wujistic includes subjects such as historic dictionaries, drama, erotics, ethics, logic, poetics, medicine, philosophy, etc. For complete six-set collection see ISBN 0-85484-0. 494 Clay Sanskrit Library publishes Sanskrit literature with downloadable materials, online resources, sacred texts, Hinduism Sanskrit documents collection, documents in ITX format of Upanishads, Stotras etc. GRETIL, Goodingen Register of Electronic Texts in Indian Languages, a cumulative register of the numerous download sites for electronic texts in Indian languages.